There's been billions of dollars of investment within the United States by various uh, chemical, chemical producers within the country. It really has been a game changer. Well, one of the big things to what AJ said is that it's a game changer, particularly for some of the particular hydrocarbons that are used in the chemical industry. In a chemical manufacturing process, there's a lot of products that are used, everything from crude oil to natural gas. But what's interesting about shale gas is that shale gas has some other hydrocarbons, which are very valuable derivatives for the chemical industry. Such things as methane, ethane, propane, and butane are now being sourced here in North America instead of being uh, imported. And what that does for the United States chemical industry is it gives them access to lower cost available resources that the industry otherwise had to import. And that's going to be able to change the cost economics of the industry all the way down to products that are sold to manufacturers that uh, consume uh, consumable goods. So the opportunities here are um, competitive advantages as well as moving away from the dependency on crude oil. One of the bigger um, issues that, that, that's a, a real benefit to North America, we see the opportunity is to shift the entire petroleum footprint to a domestic footprint fueled by natural gas. So today, what we think that we can help clients understand is what is the overall landscape? What are the big issues that, that companies need to be thinking about? What are the strategic opportunities for investment? How can you take advantage of this current situation in terms of your procuring of energy and feedstocks? What should your strategy be long term in terms of do you have a large fleet service? Is it, does it make sense for you to convert that fleet service over to uh, natural gas. If you are a part of the renewable ind industry, solar, wind, biomass, biofuel, you probably need to rethink your strategy because those renewables now have to think differently about how they're going to compete with a natural resource that was not, that traditionally wasn't available. You have to think about a whole new strategy now. From a tax perspective, there are certainly advantages um, within the state or federal level to bring the investment here to certain parts of the U.S. And one other thing that we help uh, clients understand is when you think about the new business opportunities that shale gas is bringing about in terms of new products, new services, new adventures, who are the right partners that you should be thinking about from a mergers and acquisition standpoint, maybe there's strategies that you need to employ in terms of advancing your portfolio forward to take advantage of this so that you can compete on a, on a global basis.